Sometimes the data you want to look up can come from more than one table. For example, we have two tables for commission rates, which are based on the number of years worked by the employee. We can use named ranges and if function to direct the lookup to the appropriate table. Create named ranges for them and use the name directly in the table array argument. To create a named range, select the cells and type the name you want in the name box to the left of the formula bar. For example, select F3 to G11 and enter table 1 in the name box. Repeat the same for table 2. Use this expression to get the commission. The formula uses the number of years to determine which commission rate table to use. Use the if function as the table array argument to determine which table to use. If the number of years is less than 2, table 1 is returned, else table 2. Meaning, if years is less than 2, table 1 is used as table array, else table 2 is used as table array. If number of years is less than 2, commission is returned from table 1. Copy the formula down. You can see if the number of years is greater than 2, commission is returned from table 2. We can also use named ranges and the indirect function to direct the lookup to the appropriate table. The company gives bonus based on job title and level. There are four levels. Name the four ranges, level 1, level 2, etc. Use this formula. Indirect returns the reference specified by a text string. The reference text argument is a text representation of a cell reference or a named range. B2 contains the text level 1. Indirect attempts to convert that into a cell or range reference. Since reference text is not a valid range reference, indirect checks the named ranges and returns the named range level 1. Bonus for manager is returned from level 1 table. Copy the formula down. You can see bonus for engineer is returned from level 3 table. To download practice excel file, please click on the link in the description. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel.